Hi guys! Welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I will be doing a review on the makeup products that I have from BLK Cosmetics. First is their All Day Matte Liquid Foundation and the other one is their All Day Brightening Plus Correcting Concealer. These two makeup products have been out in the market for quite some time now and ngayon ko lang talaga siya i-review. This foundation is worth 499 pesos while their concealer cost 349 pesos. Just for your reference, guys, I have a combination skin type, meaning to say I tend to oil up more on my T-zone compared to the other parts of my face. And I already did my regular skin prepping before doing this video because I want to know if these two products from BLK Cosmetics will work well together with the skincare products that I am using. If you guys want to know my thoughts, keep watching! Let's talk about their packaging first. Pagsasabayin ko na kasi almost the same lang naman sila. Ayun na nga yung regular BLK Cosmetics All Day Matte Liquid Foundation or All Day Brightening Concealer and then sa pinakababa, nandun yung tagline. And kung sa tabihan, nandito makikita yung mga claims, yung mga directions, yung mga ingredients. And these two are made in Taiwan and I'm glad na cruelty free pala ang BLK Cosmetics which is a good thing for me. And sa taas, makikita nyo yung shade para may reference na and sa taas, makikita nyo yung shade para may reference na din kayo. At the back, actually parang nalito ako kasi may 15 sa foundation and 7 sa concealer which I thought is the shade name. Yun pala, the beauty consultant advised me na they are from the advent calendar. So, ang concern ko lang, sana may talagang packaging or box yung kanilang makeup products na hindi porke na uh, ka-advent calendar yun na talaga yung packaging all over kasi nakakalito siya ayan, uh, bubuksan ko na si foundation wow it looks so classy, alam mo yun parang, parang mamahalin siyang foundation pero this is worth 499 pesos ayan yung itsura niya and wala ka namang gaano makikita kung ito-turn mo yung pinaka glass packaging pero sa likod nandito yung all day matte liquid foundation SPF 35 and of course the shade ayan yung itsura niya alam mo yun it looks so classy parang if makikita mo itong foundation na to and mag-aalala ka ng isang artista talaga si Anne Curtis talaga yung maaalala mo kasi yet super simple lang pero it looks so mamahalin eh. Ayan, it comes in a pump para mas hygienic and kamukha niya yung NARS liquid foundation. And itry natin siya. Maglalagay lang ako ng two pumps on the back of my hand. Ooh, ang bilis niya mag-dispense ng product. Ah, wait lang, hindi pala. Ah, ang tigas ng pump. Wait. Ayan. Ayan guys, nakikita niyo ba? Two pumps of product. Pero kahit two pumps na siya kasi sa ibang foundation, Two pumps parang ang dami na, pero ito parang ang unti lang. And this foundation has a thick consistency as well. Kita nyo, hindi siya ganun karani. Although it smells like plastic. Yeah, it smells like pala bla, bla, plastic. It smells like plastic, pero lagay natin siya. Ooh, okay. Alam mo yung isang lagay mo pa lang, alam mo parang natural na yung coverage niya. And I'm gonna zoom you in closer. If you guys are kind of wondering, bakit ang gagamitin ko lang to spread the product all over my face is a sponge and hindi na brush. Kasi I wanna use or I wanna test the product kung paano ba ako talaga maglagay ng mga regular foundation or regular makeup products. So for the foundation, more on the sponge ako sa pag apply kaya yun. natural coverage yung binibigay niya. So, by the looks of it, parang si porcelain medyo maputi on my skin tone. Pero may papakita ko sa inyong clip. Check this out. Guys, nag-swatch ako ng BLK liquid foundation. Yung nasa taas, yung lightest. And yung nasa baba, second to the lightest. Itong second to the lightest, parang after 5 minutes nag-oxidize na siya. So, sabi ni Ate Girl or ni Beauty Consultant, yung pinaka- lightest daw. So, yung nasa taas. Super pala siya mag-oxidize. I am not a 
Oxidic, guys. Kaya nagulat ako bakit nag-oxidize siya sa akin. Buti nag-test muna ako or nag-swatch ako ng ibang shade and then lumibot muna ako sa mall. Tapos, kumuha ako ng lighter shade and I think porcelain is the lightest shade already. So, first layer, it gives a natural coverage. Let's see if buildable ba naman to. I wanna add three more layers. Ah, tigas ng pump. Sige, four na lang. Good thing na itong foundation naman na to is blendable, hindi siya nagseset agad-agad. This foundation is very blendable but not really buildable kasi kahit 2 layers na, ayan, nakikita pa rin yung mga pimple marks ko. Most especially on this part of my face. And ayan nga yung nag-iisa dyan. Now, let's proceed to their concealer. I got the shade Honey. Kasi ito yung sinwatch sa akin ni Beauty Consultant na okay naman. Pero if ang magiging perusal mo is yung box, look at porcelain kung gano'n siya kaputi. And the honey kung gano'n siya kadar. Wait, hindi ko makuha sa box. Kumakuha sa box. Wait lang. Same with the foundation, ang packaging itong concealer na to is super straight to the point. From BLK Cosmetics ako, and ako ay isang concealer, at ako ay in the shade Honey. Ayan, nasa ilalim. Pero, if ito compare mo ha, tingnan niyo yung gano'n ka dark sa box, and gano'n siya ka light mismo. So, let's see. Buksan na din natin to. Doe foot applicator siya, and this smells like a regular concealer. So, ilagay ko siya sa akin. Oo, talagang mas dark talaga yung nabigay sa akin ni ate girl. Ang dali ng applicator. Ang ganda ng applicator ng concealer. Oo, mas blendable to compare dun sa foundation kanina. Itong concealer ng BLK Cosmetics, wala akong nakita ang coverage sa kanya. Although it's blendable, wala akong nakita ang coverage. Hindi niya natakpan yung mga pimple marks or dark spots ko. So, parang pandagdag lang siya sa kapal na pinigay na ng foundation. My face looks so flat, but I will be doing the rest of my makeup. And then, magbibigay din ako ng updates sa inyo every now and then. Hi guys! So, nakalimutan ko nga palang sabihin sa inyo kanina na natapos ako ng application at 3pm. And then, ang oras na ngayon is 7.14 in the evening. So, this foundation has been on my face for like 4 4 hours na and I haven't found any difference ganun pa rin siya kung anong inapply ko by the way guys highlighter yun kasi tinapos ko yung makeup look at pinilm ko siya and i-upload ko siya sa aking youtube channel and facebook account but anyways we're not talking about the makeup look we're talking about the foundation and the concealer I haven't found anything different ano yun nga nga Although, nakita ko parang na-emphasize na niya lang yung aking mga laugh lines and medyo nag-cake dito sa part na to. Yan, dyan sa part na yan. But nonetheless, okay naman siya on the other parts of my face. So, let's see if magtagal-tagal kung meron bang difference. And yan, may Manila paper. And magulo dito, huwag nyo nalang pansinin yun kasi may ginagawa pa dito sa bahay namin. And I'll get back to you again. Siguro maya-maya pa para magbigay ng another update. Ayun na nga guys yung sinasabi ko sa inyo kanina. This foundation has been on my face for 7 hours na. But I haven't found any difference at all. Nag-oil up ng konti pero again, super minimal. And still intact on my face which is isa talaga sa mga claims ng BLK foundation and sa concealer. Okay pa rin naman siya. Pero, dito sa foundation kasi mas kita mong nagtatagal siya. And, masasabi ko na itong foundation na to and concealer is good for 7 hours. And, parang kaya niya pang magtagal sa face if i-extend or more than 7 hours. Kasi, oh, ayan nga, wala akong nakikitang nabubura na foundation or concealer or what not. Okay na okay pa rin siya, guys. So, itong foundation na to, okay siya sa mga working girls, sa mga estudyante. Lalo na yung mga shift nila is for 7 hours or 8 hours or more. Talagang kapit kung kapit talagang pag-uusapan. Ito yung hinangaan ko dito sa BLK Cosmetics Foundation and Concealer. 
Ayan. Kahit na nagbibigay siya ng natural coverage, okay lang. At least, long-lasting. So, that's it for today's video, guys. Maraming salamat sa panonood. Please click here to subscribe to my channel. And please click here to subscribe to my boyfriend's channel. Maraming salamat!